I bought these used Justin boots from shopgoodwill.com, but when they arrived, I noticed that they had FD stamped on the inside. FD stands for factory defect. So today in this video, I'm gonna talk about factory defect boots or factory seconds and what you need to know before you get a pair for yourself or if you notice FD in a pair of used boots. So let's get into it. I'm just here to connect ya and then I'll be on my way. Hey everybody, my name is Jeremiah Craig. Thank you for coming back to the channel. If you like this type of content, please hit that like button. It costs you nothing and also subscribe and comment down below as well. I'm a regular shopper at shopgoodwill.com. I like to see what kind of boots that I can get there for cheap so that I can have more boots to do more videos, right? And I recently won these Justin boots with a bid of $12. They are my size, my true size of a 12B, so I was pretty pumped to check them out and share my experience with you guys. Only when they arrived, I noticed they had FD stamped on the inside, which stands for factory defect. And I didn't see that in the pictures on shopgoodwill.com. As you can see here, there's no picture of the FD, which might be critical information before buying a pair of boots but hey that's shopgoodwill.com it's always hit and miss there the pictures are awful which is another reason why it's kind of fun but i'm still happy for the opportunity to do a video on factory defect boots the fd like i mentioned stands for factory defect and it's sometimes also known as factory seconds and it means that they did not pass the quality standards test when they reached the end of the production line most often, you can get these types of boots at factory outlet stores. Justin still has a factory outlet store, and on their website, they explain that these boots in the stores range from closeout and discontinued styles to boots deemed as factory defect, and they say that they cannot often see why, or styles that did not quite make the cut over the long haul. So the defect could literally be anything. It could be something cosmetic, like the stitching is off, or it could be something that is more detrimental to quality, leading to the boots not lasting as long and maybe fitting weirdly when they break in. So this makes it difficult to see what the defect might be, since it could be anything. And there is very rarely, if ever, an explanation as to why the boots are a defect. You kind of just have to look at them and figure it out, maybe guess for yourself. And it's even more difficult on a pair of used factory defect boots because they've already been worn. So on this boot, it could be the ugly green stitching that looks kind of random on this boot. Maybe it was supposed to be brown. Or it could be that the side seams on the inside of the left boot don't line up as well as they do on the right boot. You can see that they are about a half an inch off inside the left boot. And when I put these boots on, it feels like my heel is lower in the left boot, kind of like it's sitting in a divot. Very awkward feeling. Or it could be the fact that the toe box is kind of jutting out the side here. It kind of ruins the clean lines of the cowboy boot. But that could also have happened from the break-in process. The point is that companies have boots that don't pass their quality assurance tests. And they still try to sell them at their factory outlets to make some of that money back. Sometimes it's fine and you're able to get decent boots at cheap prices, but that also means that they might not last as long or break in and start fitting strangely over the long haul. Had I known that these were factory defect boots when I purchased them, I probably wouldn't put a bid in on them, but I am thankful for the fact that they were because it gives us an opportunity to do a video on it and start a conversation in the comments below. Let me know your experience with factory defect boots or factory seconds boots down in the comments. I would love to read your stories and that should also help folks coming through whether they're deciding on making a purchase on factory defect boots or like me, ended up with a pair, a used pair with FD stamped on the inside. Thank you so much for watching today. Don't forget to subscribe. Love you so much, and I will see you next time. Peace. It's factory defect, but it's not a secret. Thanks to the stamp inside. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching today. Why don't you check out this other video up here? Or I got a music video down here I think you might enjoy. Don't forget to subscribe up here, and I will see you next time. Peace. Have a good one.